The name of the festival is in honor of this city, once the center of industry. Organizers say the fire represents the industrial hearth and the fish is symbolic of the fresh fish you're going to find in Lake Erie and the Black River. A celebration of Lorraine's past and what could be. Here we are, we see a lot of empty storefronts, we see some uh, vacant buildings but they're about to be transformed. We were talking this morning with uh, Emily Hogue, festival director of the uh, Firefish Festival. We bring people to Lorraine so people can see what potential it has. There's gonna be art in the alleyways, arts on the street. We just look for talent that we think is worth celebrating in, in Lorraine. One of our main buildings, it's kind of our centerpiece, Old Lorraine National Bank. I suddenly imagined my work in there, but it's a vast building. They asked me if I could just gather together other artists to do it, and it was easy to do. Time we're going to be transforming about six or seven old storefronts and department stores. Uh, all been vacant for years and years. We're going to be transforming them into galleries, interactive art exhibits, installations, and some very cool performance. And we're hoping that artists and musicians want to not only come and perform, but maybe rent, buy spaces, and transform that area into another arts district. So Firefish is sort of a representation of the the future and the past coming together. This huge piece of art right here is literally going to go up in flames. At the end, we burn it with a great ceremony and ritual after a parade, a very kind of Mardi Gras-ish parade with belly dancers and drummers. There's a certain kind of pagan element. But it's not like your typical parade with cars and politicians and soccer teams. Fire is an opportunity for rebirth. The Firefish Festival is re an opportunity for rebirth for Lorraine. That will bring people to discover Lorraine and what a great special community it is.